guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my garage sale haul that I got. Yesterday I went thrifting, garage selling, whatever you want to call it, around my apartment. <laughs> Just drove around. I was really bored yesterday and there was actually a lot of garage sales. So I'm going to show you guys what I got. garage selling you just never know what you're gonna find and it always is really cheap and good deals so to begin I got this really cute metal it says like silver plated I don't know I could clean it up but I kind of like the look of it antique -y. it was at this really big garage sale and it was a lot of um, older people and so like they had some really cool antique stuff and it was just really interesting to see all these old things. So it was 50 cents, which is really good deal for this little cute pot. So I think what I'm gonna do is plant a little succulent in it and have it sit outside. I have this little, oh, what's it called? Little like ladder thing that my plants sit on. So that's what I'm gonna do with this. One of the first scratch sales I went to, I got a couple of things. I just got Uno cards for 25 cents. Um, so Tyler and I can play, or when we have people over, I just didn't have the game. And I was like, oh, I like Uno, so I'll grab that. And then I got some Norwex stuff. So if you don't know what Norwex is, it's like very, it's kind of expensive cleaning stuff. And it's very like good for the environment, like no chemicals and all of that stuff, I think. So, I don't honestly know too much about it, but I know my mom gets it and my mother-in-law, soon-to-be mother-in-law, gets it. And she actually was showing me this one day. It is the Norwex Cleaning Paste um, for polishing and cleaning stuff. <laughs> so, I grabbed it. It was 50 cents. And then Tyler's sister-in-law, so my soon-to-be sister-in-law, is having a Norwex party. And I found the same thing on the website that, like, she's selling it. And this was $30. So I got this for 50 cents. Really good deal. It's barely used. Another thing I got from Norwex is this little like dusting cloth. Ooh, it's like glowing in the camera. Okay, sorry about that. <laughs> but it has like a microfiber on this side and a microfiber little things for dusting. And normally these are pretty expensive too. And I got this for a dollar. At the same garage sale, I found these Sup House thank you cards, 48 of them, and this was $2, and I was like, oh, I'll have to, well, let me adjust the lighting, sorry. So if you can see, it comes with stickers, and then I'll show you all of them. It's like a whole bunch of different thank you cards with this really cute floral designs on them. All says thank you and all has kind of different floral patterns on it and I thought that was a good deal for stickers and I'll be needing them for a bridal shower or a wedding so I thought that was a great find also. Next I found these little, let me see, these little picture frames at a garage sale for 10 cents each. I thought they'd be perfect for putting Polaroids in and just setting them on my desk or something. Good find, and for 10 cents, I mean, why not? At this same place I got the picture frames, <laughs> this is really weird, but I'll use them. It's just a bag of buttons. Um, it looks like, you know when you get a new shirt and it comes with like a little button and a bag? It looked like they just collected them. And I also keep mine, too, because as you guys know, or if you don't know, I'm going to school for apparel design and production, so I make a lot of clothes, and this way I can just find buttons in there and I don't have to go buy them. And yeah, it's a good way not to waste stuff. So I figured for 10 cents, why not add to my little button collection? All right, so the next place I got this cute little pumpkin um, I'll use as the decoration for fall. This was 25 cents, it's a little fabric. I thought it'd just be cute sitting somewhere in my house, not really sure, but and then at the same place I got two jackets um, they were both 75 cents and I'll show you them here and then I'll insert I'll insert a clip of me styling them so the first one is this I think it says Oscar 
De Arante? Oscar De Larante. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But it's very like a wool kind of material and a little blazer. I thought it would be really cute. And here is how I'd style it. So I was thinking for styling this one pair to make it more casual, pairing it with this kind of like edgier tee, a choker, and then some ripped jeans. It's a little big on me on the shoulders, but I just think it'd be really cute to make it more casual and just a fun outfit for going to get some coffee or whatever. Next, I got this zip up jacket. Okay, it might look kind of old lady-ish, but I thought it was kind of cool. I really like, really like the tweed kind of look to it. It's really soft and I think this kind of material is really coming in. So this is also something that I could wear in the fall. And here's how I would style it. All right, and here with this tweed jacket, I just rolled up the cuffs. They have this cute little like slit in it. And I'm wearing the same jeans as before, make it more casual with this tank turtleneck tucked in. Hair the same way and some hoops. So I just think I feel very like clueless vibes in this, like I feel like a boss babe in it. I really like it, it has some pockets. Um, I don't know, let me know what you think. Are these too old for my age? <laughs> Or is it cute? I don't know. I think they're cute and fun. Um, perfect for fall. And yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Another thing I got is a leaf blower, but that's in the garage. And I don't think that's that interesting. But we picked up one of those for $10. Um, just because we'll probably need one around the house once fall comes. And after Tyler mows, you know how like the dead grass gets everywhere? The other day I was sweeping it up, so I was like, oh, I wish I had a leaf blow. Well, now I do. One of the last stops I made, I got this really cool gold tray, and it's mirror. Ooh. It's mirror on the inside, so I thought it would be really pretty to take like my skincare stuff and like set it all cute and nicely in my room. Um... So I think that's what I'm going to do with it. This was only a dollar and I thought it was really cool. It feels really nice and like sturdy, very like antique looking. So I thought that was also a good find. Alright, and one of the last things I got was this ceramic pot. And I got it for 50 cents and I just thought it was really pretty and has a bunch of dirt in it. So I need to clean it out and replant something. But I'll have to go to the store and get a plant. But yeah, for 50 cents. Alright, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed my little garage, sta garage sale. Wow, why can't I say that? Garage sale thrifting video. Yeah. <laughs> and let me know what else you guys want to see next. I hope you guys have a good day. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, Girl Scouts. Alright, bye.